Hello guys and welcome to this tutorial where I will show you how to quickly and easily deposit money to your KuCoin account. I will show you how you can deposit any fiat currencies, US dollar, euro or anything else or how you can also deposit crypto so Bitcoin, US dollar tether or any other cryptocurrency. If you want to create an account and you don't have a KuCoin account already you can simply go down to the video description, click on the link and then you will get to exactly this page right here and you can participate in some bonuses as you can see right here you get some nice rewards and you can actually get up to $510 of nice bonuses so you just click on the link then you get here just click down here on sign up enter your details right here and then you're ready to go once you have created an account and you log in for the first time you will get to this page right here and the first thing we can do is to enable two-factor authentication and to do that we simply go up here to the top right on our profile and then we go down here to account security so we click on that, then will, we will get to this page right here, as you can see. And here we have this point, Google verification. I would definitely recommend you to use the Google Authenticator because then you have a second uh, layer of security. So for you, there will be just set right here. Then you have to click on it and then you can connect it. And then you have a second layer of security, which is really important for your security of your account. So the second thing we can also do is to verify our identity on the KuCoin account. And to do that, we simply go up here again to our profile and then we go down to KYC verification, which stands for know your customer. So just uh, that the platform knows it's also some regulatory. So um, just so they know that uh, you are a real person and there's no, for example, money laundering going on or something like that. All right. So the first uh, option you can do is just to know, you know, uh, enter your country, your name and your ID number. And once you've done that, you can use some basic uh, functionality of the platform. You can deposit and use uh, trade crypto and withdraw it. But if you, for example, you want to have higher uh, limits um, for withdrawals as you can see right here or if you also want to use the futures trading platform with up to 100x leverage you also need the advanced verification and if you want to have daily trading limits and if you also want uh, of 70,000 US dollars and you want to use fiat for example you want to deposit with uh, euro or US dollar tether then you need the advanced verification which uh, is pretty simple it only takes a few minutes um, you just have to upload a picture of your identity uh, of your ID and then you also have to take a picture of your yourself and then that's basically is you just have to submit it and then after for example one day it took for me about one day then you will have all these features enabled as you can see you can now use as I did now I'm completely verified I can use all these features um, on the platform all right so now we can deposit and to do that we simply go up here to the top right go to this wallet icon right here and then we click on main account and now as you can see here we get an overview of all the balances that we can hold on our account which is a whole lot all these cryptocurrencies and of course also fiat currencies so now first i want to show you how you can deposit for example euro so you just type in euro there you have it it's a fiat currency just click on deposit right here and then as you can see we have two options the first one is just with a sepa bank transfer you also have zero percent fees and down here we have all the relevant information that we need so we have the uh, account name that we have to transfer the money to we have the eban right here down here which we can copy and use in our bank transfer and we also have the reference note which we just have to include in our transfer in the reference code so they know that this is a the transaction that came from our bank account so they can accredit it to our account right here on KuCoin. The second option is of course to use uh, your credit card. So you just, uh, there's a 3% fee. So you can just type in the amount right here, for example, $200, uh, 200 euro in this case. And then you can just click down here on deposit. And then as you can see, you have to bind your uh, credit card and then you can type in all your details right here, click on next. And then you can also deposit with credit card instantly right here. That's also really simple. If you use the bank transfer, it will take about one to two days for it to arrive right here on your account. All right, for example, if you want to uh, deposit any other fiat currency, as you can see, you have many different options right here. For example, if you have the Swiss franc, if you have the Canadian dollar, Australian dollar, anything like that. Or of course, if you, for example, if in the United States, you can use the US dollar, as you can see right here, and then you can just use your credit card right here and um, just deposit from here, which is also really simple. So that's one option, but that's actually not all. If you don't have a, an option right here that you are that you like for your currency, another option would also just to be to go down up here to buy crypto and then use a third party. They also offer some uh, other uh, options, for example, Apple Pay. So that's also another option how you can deposit right here. All right, so next up, I also want to show you how you can deposit any cryptocurrency. So you just go up here to your profile again, click on main account. There you get all these cryptocurrencies and then you can just type in anyone you would like, for example, BTC. So you can just go to Bitcoin, click on deposit right here 
and there you have the address that you, which, which you can deposit Bitcoin to right now. Um, of course, if you choose any cryptocurrency, for example, the US dollar Tether, which you can also see I have $120 deposited, you can always uh, use different networks. For example, this is the ERC20, so the Ethereum network, which you can use to deposit any cryptocurrency. But you can, of course, also use, for example, the Tron network, which, which I prefer because it has, low, it has lower fees. Um, so you can also use, of course, different networks right here. And that's how it works. So you select your cryptocurrency right here. You can select your account. Uh, it doesn't really matter. You can deposit directly to your trading account if you want to trade with it directly. Otherwise, you can also deposit it to your main account and then transfer it. Uh, doesn't really matter um, and then you can see down here your address uh, because you can choose your network right here and then you get the address for the network you've chosen all right so that's how you can deposit any cryptocurrency last thing i would like to show you is if you want to use so if you have it on your main account you can just see it right here but you can you can't really use it if you want to trade with it uh, you have to first transfer it to your trading account and to do that you simply go here to transfer and then you select the current the coin you would like to transfer and then you can choose from your main account to your trading account and type in the amount you want and then you can easily transfer it and you can transfer it back and forth as many times as you like and basically that's how you can get money onto your kucoin account all right guys don't forget to create an account on kucoin using the link down from the video description to get the up to 510 dollars of bonus just click on the link and then go down here to sign up enter your details and you are ready to go as always if you have any questions always feel free to ask them in the comments